everyone. I am going to show you guys something today that a lot of you guys may know and a lot of you guys may not know, okay? Now, this is for educational purposes only. In no shape, form, nor fashion am I advocating for anybody to go out there, apply for a ton of different credit cards, and jack up their credit, okay? In no shape, form, nor fashion am I advocating for that. However, there are a lot of you guys out there who um, may be looking to rebuild your credit with credit cards and you're going to be using these credit cards responsibly. And what I mean by responsibly, it means you're going to only be charging things on these credit cards that you know that you can afford to pay off, okay? Please do not go and get these credit cards putting yourselves in deeper debt than you already are in. Only use these credit cards for rebuilding credit, okay? But again, this video is for educational purposes only. It is not meant for anybody to go out there and jack up your credit even more, okay? I'm gonna put a lot of this stuff in a blog post on my website, reason being is because YouTube has been acting really funny about putting a lot of links in the description box, so check out the um, link on my website, and it's gonna be in the description box down below. Check out that, and it's gonna have a full list of websites that you guys can actually use to go and see if you can um, be pre-approved for some of these credit cards using this shopping cart trick okay this is only to be used to rebuild your credit all right now the first thing that you're going to need to do is make sure that you're logged into an incognito window where you're browsing privately okay you come over to chrome all you're going to do is click on the little three buttons over there to the side and you're going to see new incognito window you click on that and it's going to pop up this incognito window you're going to make sure you're going to want to make sure that you're definitely in an incognito window that is first and foremost okay make sure you're in an incognito window okay so the website that we're actually going to use is overstock.com we're going to use overstock.com and what you want to do when you come to these websites is you want to add something to your cart that's over fifty dollars okay over fifty dollars um you can try to do something um personally i prefer to try to do things that are over a hundred dollars because it seems to work a little bit better um, word of advice, so if you go to websites like this, which is overstock.com, if you get pre-approved for this credit card, do not enter in your full social security number, only the last four digits, okay? I would definitely tell you guys probably to stay away from this one if you're not planning on buying anything from overstock.com, but again, this is for educational purposes only. Do not go out here picking up a lot of these credit cards to run your credit up and you're not paying these things off, okay? Use these credit cards responsibly only for rebuilding your credit, okay? They may do a hard pull or a soft pull. More often times than not, it's going to be a soft pull, okay? It's not gonna be a hard pull. More often times than not, it's gonna be a soft pull. But I have heard stories of people who have been getting hard pulls to their credit um, applying for some of these credit cards. Again, educational purposes only, okay? So what you're going to want to do again is add something over $50. I'm going to try to add something over $100 to the cart and see if we can get this pre-approval, okay? Now this right here is $74 on sale. I'm actually going to add two of these to the cart, okay? All right. So as you can see, my total here is $74, so I need to add two of these. All right, now it's $148. So now what we're gonna do is we're actually going to go to the checkout, okay? We're gonna go to the checkout and here we're actually going to continue as a guest. You can create an account here if you choose to, however, we're going to continue as a guest, okay? Now, what you're gonna wanna do here is you're actually want, going to wanna enter in your information as, as it appears on your credit report, okay? Everything needs to be the exact same as it is, your name, your address, and everything needs to match, okay? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pause this right here and I'm gonna come back after I fill in all of this information. Okay, I entered in all of the personal information and I do have some things over there blocked over there on the side because my, uh, the Juice Man's information rather is there. As you can see, congratulations, you've been pre-approved for the Overstock store card. Now that is all I did. I didn't enter in any social security numbers or anything like that, okay? The only thing that I did was go through this incognito window because you're gonna need to be in an incognito window, um, enter in the information exactly as it is on your credit report and this stuff will be popping up. 
Now it may not work on all of the websites. Okay. It may not work on all of the websites. So just go through and see which ones that it will work on. If it is a credit card that you're interested in, again, use these things for educational purposes only. Do not go on applying for these credit cards going out here spending money that you know that you do not have only buy things that you know that you can pay off before the billing cycle is over okay please i'm begging you guys again educational purposes only use this to rebuild your credit if you have tried to apply for credit cards before and you were unsuccessful okay go out there get you um a few of these credit cards or maybe one to start and rebuild your credit that way, okay? I'm gonna put up a whole write-up on this on my blog, reason being is because YouTube is a little funny with adding things to the description box and um, I don't really have time for all of that. So I'm gonna add all of this stuff on my blog, all of the different um, websites you can go to to actually do this shopping cart trick. Like I said, some of you guys may already know about this and some of you guys may not. This is for educational purposes. For those of you who are looking to rebuild your credit with credit cards, you guys should definitely check out this shopping cart trick. I will see you guys in the next video. And again, remember, responsibly. Bye.